That dog stayed with her. Uh, she was able to stay warm with the dog, and uh, probably uh, one of the things that saved her life. She cuddled with the dog. She was very happy about that, so she loves that dog. The medic and I arrived on scene, and we were probably there about five minutes and found her in a ravine about a half a mile from the house. Oh, my gosh, she's our angel. <laughs> I mean, Victoria is, she's, you know, our angel. I kneeled down next to her, told her, hey, I'm going to take you to her mommy. She smiled at me and put her arms up. I picked her up. But that dog stayed with her, and I believe that they will have a relationship probably for a very long time. I think the dog initially was apprehensive of me. I was a little concerned it might bite me as I first walked up. Um, but as I just walked right past the dog, I think the dog realized I was there to help the girl. You can see the dog's expression almost turned to a smile. Um, it came right to the helicopter and jumped right in. I'm very thankful that I'm able to hold her now and talk to her and everything else. Well, she's just all smiles right now and she's talking very good and very happy. We have to give a lot of credit to Blue, the dog. He pretty much stayed with her all night and I'm hoping that that's what kept her warm and safe.